Hello, it's Helder here, and today I want to talk to you about this P1 body cam that I picked up from a company called Rexing. Now, when we think of body cams, we think of law enforcement, security personnel, first responders, and of course, that completely makes sense. As a matter of fact, for them and for most of their departments, wearing a body cam isn't even an option. It is actually a must. In today's global climate, it's not just law enforcement and first responders that seek these types of devices. It's also the average citizens. Everyday citizens are put in situations where they wish sometimes that they had a body cam to record what was going on. And many are opting to do so. And that's why I wanted to go ahead and bring this Rexing P1 body cam to your attention. So let's get into some more details on this P1 body cam. The things that I do like about this P1 body cam is its form factor. It is extremely light, so you barely even notice that you have it on, and it's rugged. It doesn't feel like some little inexpensive thing that's going to fall apart on you. It is waterproof and shockproof, and when you do get it in your hands and feel it, you could tell that uh, there is some substance there. When it comes to mounting this camera, it does have two options. It comes with a chest mount or just a regular clip that you can pretty much mount to anything, and it also has an epaulet or a shoulder mount. There is a 3000 milliamp battery in this P1 body cam. It also has 64 gigabytes of built-in memory. Now, some people might find the fact that it doesn't have an expansion slot or a removable SD card might be a downfall. But when it comes to the purpose of these body cams, it's all about being rugged, weatherproof, being able to take the pulling and the shoving and the scraping. So by not having that SD card, it actually adds to the integrity of the body cam. Operating this body cam is quite simple. There are buttons on the left hand side, buttons along the bottom with a two inch LCD display. On the other side, there is also a series of other buttons. And I will show you one by one what each of these buttons do. First off here on the bottom left hand side, we have the power button. So you're gonna hold that in, let go, and it starts up, you'll hear that sound. The sound does get annoying, but if you are using this for security or outdoors, those louder sound cues actually come in handy. But keep in mind that there also is a stealth mode where you can disable all those sound effects as well as any of the LED lighting that comes on the body cam. So right off the bat, as soon as you turn off the camera up on the top right, basically tells you how many hours you have of recording right underneath that, how much free space you have on your internal memory. And then on the bottom, there are a bunch of others, what your camera name would be, your police ID, anything like that, that you would want to configure that would uh, make sense, let's say to your operation. And then of course there is a time and date stamp as well as battery level. Going up from the power button, there is the USB port. And of course comes with a USB cable for charging purposes, as well as transferring data to your laptop. You have your OK button in the middle here to be able to select whatever you would want to select. And then there is the return button to be able to back out of the screen. As you could tell by the quality of the video, it's not bad. It's not bad for its intended purpose. And of course, built in such a rugged case. Remember, the purpose here is not to post the latest and coolest YouTube action video. It's meant to document information when you pretty much need it the most. Keep in mind that I will put a lot more information in my blog post, so be sure to check it out. I will place that link in the comments field below. There is also a panic button feature, and you activate that by holding down the OK button for a few seconds. And flashing lights in the front, and a bit of a siren. Once again, I really don't have any use for that feature, but maybe you do. With the infrared night vision, once again, it is designed to capture that moment that's right in front of you. Not that's 50 feet down the block or all the way down the street. It is designed to capture what is happening directly in front of you. And when it comes to this P1, it actually does a pretty good job of it. So bottom line, if you're in the market for a body cam that is ruggedly built, extremely lightweight and compact, long battery life, plenty of memory storage. Definitely take a look at this P1 body cam by Rexing. Good boy. Good boy.